So great having you join us for this devotion today, brought to you by Wisconsin Lutheran Chapel and Student Center from my backyard. Yes, as you can see, it was a snowy week this past week, wasn't it? 16 inches of snow or something like that fell during the course of a week. Maybe you got a chance to get out and enjoy that snow a little bit. Some snowshoeing or skiing or sledding or maybe even making a snow angel. Or maybe you didn't enjoy the snow that much if you had to walk through some slush or had to dig your car out from being plowed in. Whatever the case, there is some beauty in a snowfall, isn't there, when white covers just about everything that you can see? It always brings to mind a passage from Isaiah chapter 1, verse 18, where the Lord prophesies about our sins. It goes like this, Come now, let us settle the matter, says the Lord. Though your sins are like scarlet, they shall be white as snow. Though they are like crimson, they shall be as wool. What a beautiful promise from our God. Come, let us settle the matter, he says. In God's mind, the matter's already determined. It's already decided. He's the one who's decided. He's decided that you and I are forgiven. What's amazing about that is we can't deny the next phrase, though our sins are like scarlet. These words were originally written through the prophet Isaiah to the people of Judah, and there was no question about their sins. They had turned their backs on God, forsaken his word, and were worshiping false gods. But if we really think about it, while our sins might not always be obvious to others, we certainly know that, that we are guilty as well. We know that there are far too many times our words and actions don't measure up to what God says. We complain, we speak badly about others. So often those things pop up in our lives and we feel frustrated about the fact that we can't get past them. Is that what makes the next words of God so amazing? Though your sins are like scarlet, they shall be white as snow. Like crimson, they will be as wool. God has laid a white blanket of holiness, of righteousness, of perfection over your sins. And that perfection was won for you by Jesus. Jesus cleans you in his red blood shed on the cross so that you stand before God white and holy in Jesus' righteousness. The next time you see one of these big snowfalls and see that beautiful white covering everything, just remember what God says about your sins. Though they are like scarlet, they're washed away, made white in the righteousness of Jesus, white as snow. God bless you this week. Thanks for joining us. Remember, Jesus loves you.